Good day everyone, welcome. In this video I will show you and tell you the methods to decrease or eliminate the freezing in DaVinci Resolve completely. So guys, firstly to get the most uh, important and essential uh, things out of the way, of course it all comes down firstly to your hardware. If your hardware is too slow, too cheap and isn't compatible fully with this software because DaVinci Resolve, especially the latest version, it's quite beefy on the hardware. So you should keep that in mind. And the first thing I will tell you is that you should have a firstly uh, somewhat of a adequate processor, which is the CPU, to be able to run this application properly. Of course, enough RAM and also a good enough GPU so that it handles the various animations and everything else. So in order to fix the freezing uh, also, which is the most important, one of the most important things, you need to get an SSD, okay? Everyone's using them now, you should be one of them, of course, and using HDDs is not recommended in uh, basically pretty much any modern uh, video editing software. So just make sure to grab yourself a SSD, preferably the M.2 NVMe SSD. Uh, and after that, let us go to the preferences and I will show you how to actually decrease your freezes. So guys, firstly, you need to make sure to uh, select your GPU in the settings. So as you can see, my GPU is already automatically selected uh, and it works fine for some people. It's uh, not working fine. It's bugging out. And uh, just make sure that this check mark is set for your GPU. Also, guys, let me talk about something else as well. OK, and after this, guys, you need to go to File, Project Settings and then navigate to the master settings and under working folders, Make sure that you set your proxy generation lo uh, generation location and also your cache and gallery stills location to your fastest drive. OK, so in our case is going to be SSD, which I said is recommended way. So uh, basically project media is up to you, uh, basically, but setting it to SSD is also going to make things way smoother and faster. And basically make sure to uh, set proxy cache and gallery stills to your SSD and by this by doing this you'll make sure that this media and cache that's being generated all the time while you're working with your project will be generated to your SSD fastest SSD drive and things will be way faster. I can confirm this. I did work in this um, uh, software on the HDD it was super slow. After I moved it to SSD it was like way faster. Night, night and day difference. So these are the, the tips for you guys. Hopefully this helps you out. Of course, support us, like the video, leave a comment what you think, and of course, subscribe. See you soon.